In the last video, you heard about practicing at double and triple speed. Today, the suggestion is to go overboard with your volume. When you're talking about somebody who's yelling and screaming, and I'm not going to do it here so I don't blow out the microphone. I mean, I mean, go as loud as you can. And if somebody's really subdued, I mean, go almost to a whisper. And why would you do that? Because you're not going to speak that way in front of an audience. Well, what you're doing is you're stretching your vocal muscles. Because what I find is most people believe that when they uh, pantomime yelling, that they usually just go about this loud. They're not yelling. They think they are. And I show them on video and they say, oh yeah, I guess I wasn't very loud. You want realistic recreation. So if somebody is yelling in the steam, you got to go with it. If they're subdued, they're depressed, they're down, you got to bring that voice level down or that volume. So by going overboard, you're going to come to a more natural rate when you're in front of an audience or even in front of a camera, but you got to stretch those muscles first. In the next video, you're going to pick up yet another rehearsal idea that will help your story sound more realistic and true to your audience.